The difference between us and other injection molders is we have engineers on staff that can help you take your product from a napkin sketch all the way down through the line to designing that product, building prototypes, making a mold, running production, so we can take your napkin sketch and bring it to a finished part. Hi, I'm Kyle Bender from Falcon Plastics and we're an injection molder. Uh, we have four facilities in the United States. We have three in South Dakota, one in Tennessee. We also, also have a partnership in a manufacturing facility in Suzhou, China. We have machines between the size of 35 and 1,000 tons, so we can make anything from you know, very small beneath an inch to door frames. Let's talk about this part right here. Uh, this is a pill splitter. This shows about all of our capabilities all in one part. Regular injection molding, we have over molding with a thermal plastic, we have insert molding with this blade, and we have assembly with putting this blade guard in. So it has assembly, injection molding, over molding, and insert molding all in one part. This part requires no labor. Everything is done by automation that we designed to be able to compete with markets overseas. This is a cartridge for office products one of the large office products or Fortune 500 company, but this product is something that we've been doing for a long time. And this has a lot of different components in it, blow molded, injection molded, we do a lot of assembly with it, there's a lot of different SKUs in this product. And over the years we have to do price reductions, and so we've actually found a lot of ways through our engineering techniques to remove SKUs from this product and reduce the amount of parts that need to be assembled into making a finished working product. This is made out of a recycled polystyrene, all post-industrial recycled material. There's some innards that are made out of different types of plastics, polypropylene, polyurethane. We try and do everything we can to be as green as possible. We try and be as lean as possible. That's what manufacturing is leaning towards. Uh, this part is Falcon Plastics only product line that we own. And so this is a uh, ammo tray. We sell it to reloaders. And so the cool story behind this part actually is that this part is made all from recycled plastics. That actually helps us reduce the cost to our customers because if that scrap was getting thrown away, they would have to pay for that scrap as it was used in their part. But now we can reuse the scrap at no cost to them save them that cost, and then we get some sales out of it as well. This is the door for an enclosure for an irrigation system for farming. The cool innovation that we have here is this is an injection molded part, and then we actually have a foam in place gasket that goes around the entire part. And so what that does is it creates a watertight seal. We'll invite our material suppliers in to talk about what materials usually work best for those types of applications. Uh, we don't pretend to be material experts because we're molding experts. We have uh, CMMs in all of our facilities. We have a Vision CMM in some of them. And uh, no, we, we take quality seriously. We have an in-house tool room in one of our South Dakota facilities. We can alter incoming tools for customers if they wanted to transfer a tool from another molder to us. This is another part that we make that kind of shows some of the complexities that we get into. Uh, this is a thin-walled polycarbonate part. Uh, polycarbonate's not a fun material to run thin walls in, especially long like this. Uh, this is something that we found we can do better than almost any other molder that we're aware of. So this gets over molded here as well. There's an assembly right here that we create. We mold all the parts for this. So we produce a finished product with multiple molded pieces and multiple non-molded pieces. We have about 100 injection molding machines, but we have five blow molding machines. So one product that we blow mold would be reusable ice packs. Uh, we actually blow mold this bottle and then we put the label on it. We fill it with the fluid and then we spin weld the cap on, we package it up, and then ship it. The company never has to even handle the product. See us and other quality suppliers at d2p.com.